Hi, Peter from Nicholson Fine Foods. Today we're going to make a blackened Cajun salmon. We're going to team it with a little bit of Greek yogurt, some olive oil, balsamic garnishing pearls. I also have some fresh herbs and our red pepper finishing vinegar. Check the temperature of the pan, make sure it's nice and warm, not too hot. We need it medium heat. Sprinkle the spices onto a plate or as I've done with a piece of paper and push the salmon down firmly into the paper. Check that each area of the salmon is completely coated in the spices and try and mop up all of the spices. Then take some salt, about a half a teaspoon, and sprinkle that over the skin of the fish. That'll give us a, a nice crisp effect on the fish skin. And then lay skin side down into a medium heat pan and the cooking process will begin almost immediately. Because of the salt, the actual temperature is a little higher it's some kind of physical reaction with the salt and the heat. And you can see the cook line gradually creeping up the fish. And when it's about a third of the way up, Take a little bit of olive oil and you can drizzle it onto the spices like I'm doing there. Or you might, you might choose just to oil the pan and then flip the fish onto the oil part of the pan. Both techniques will work. As you can see, the, the fish skin is really nice and crispy. The cooking of the spices will take about 90 seconds to cook the spices and to start to push some heat down through the top of the filler. Here we are putting some Greek yogurt onto a plate. And then some picked herbs. We have flat leaf parsley and some basil leaves. So we'll just pick the herbs around the plate and then some beautiful olive oil. We're using Toscana extra virgin olive oil from Victoria. Then we lay the fillet of salmon onto the plate and we have our red pepper finishing vinegar and we'll just do a nice drizzle. The red pepper finishing vinegar goes beautifully with the salmon and it marries perfectly with both the yogurt and the black and Cajun spice mix. These are our balsamic garnishing pearls. So we've introduced a nice balsamic vinegar aspect to the flavor profile of the dish. And we just sprinkle them in a bit like fish eggs. And a little bit of extra oil over the top of the fish just to moisten it and give it a little bit of a glaze. Sprig of basil. And voila, there it is. Monday night dinner at home. It's that easy. Thanks for watching.